Hey everybody, it's Alex. Long time no video. Um, we've just been home and I work from home so yeah, we just been, oh, I, oh my gosh, the whole, almost the whole month of July it rained so we were stuck inside a lot. But when we're not, we're out at the pool when I'm finished working so and then I had Gabriel's birthday, I had my husband's birthday, and my mom's birthday was over the weekend. So we've been a little bit busy with stuff. So I've had just stuff kind of piling up here, like things I pick up from here and there. And I wanted to share with you guys. Um, school will be back in, today's August 10th, and um, Monday. And so school will be back in Monday, August 24th. And I can't tell you how excited I am so excited I'm so jealous of my friend Brie her kids went back July 30th I believe <laughs> oh so jealous but anyways so this morning I had to go to Office Depot because I needed to get paper and ink and then I needed to look for some washi tape for my friend and I wanted to check um, Tuesday morning to see what they had and I have been messing with a like travelers type journal these journals it's not a real like the real brand travelers journal um this is a three pack i think they're called moleskine or something moleskine i don't know how it's pronounced um it's called a cashier's notebook it has blank pages and you can find them at target they're three for like twelve dollars and i just saw today my my scrapbook store does have travelers notebook things and I guess um, some people use the you know the cover that the leather cover and um, that gets pretty expensive but then um, you I see people make books using just a book like this and I guess it's considered the insert and I was thinking that it, you had to get that whole thing I didn't know that it was just the inserts until I went to the store and she was telling me about it so the inserts cost like the book that kind of looks like this cost about eight dollars I think they even have them on Amazon now that I know that you can buy just this book and you don't have to buy the big leather thing but anyways point being if you want something like this these are at Target in the journal section they're like either $11.99 or $12.99 my husband bought them for me um, they're hand stitched on the side they're really nice blank pages and they're like a cream color but I've been doing some like scrapping of some stuff and this is definitely easier for me than like a 12 by 12 page it's 12 by 12 is so intimidating this is this little spot and then you can especially if you go places a lot um, different places you get to visit places like today I took some pictures we, we I took the kids Dunkin Donuts this morning and while Dunkin Donuts isn't anything crazy like Disneyland or something <laughs> um, I just took pictures of them. I saved a piece of the, like a napkin from there that I'm going to use and I'm going to document them this morning when we went out to breakfast. We all had a good time. Um, so yeah, I was looking, I went out today because I wanted to find little pieces to use. Lots of the stuff I was given, um, like this page is a bunch of those Project Life type cards and paper. I see I cut that out. I cut this out. I ripped up the paper. This is a Project Life card. This good for the soul was a project life card <laughs> and this one was a project I just cut them up and ripped them up and this was the top of a project life card so yeah that's what I and I wanted to find some stuff for this so that's that was what I did today is I had some um, cash on a gift card that I was given and so I went to go find some stuff which was fun so at Tuesday morning, I found this little knockout. You guys, this is probably all old to you guys. I have not been watching a lot of YouTube or anything, so I don't know what is really out there and what isn't. Um, so this might, this stuff might be old. So if you want to click out, no big deal. But I found this bow, and then I found an Amy Tan. Um, like little date stamp which would be good for those projects I have I have it put away um, oh let me see you know what because I've already started using some of the stuff that I had gotten I couldn't wait to share it <laughs> I 
Hold on one second. Okay. I was working on my project last night while I was Skyping with my girl Bree. I have lots of stuff. Okay, so back to this journal real quick. This is the paper that gets wrapped around it when you buy it. That's the name of it. It's the cashier's collection. You get a set of three. So that's what that was. Okay. So this was the one that I had. I don't remember if Brianna gave it to me or somebody sent it to me. So that is the one that I had. And then um, I bought a few more. So that's what I was going to share with you guys. See, I started using some of my stuff, so I couldn't wait. I said, I don't know when I'm going to be able to do a video. So I just started using it. Hold on. Okay, I think I got everything. Okay, <laughs> sorry guys. This is like take four of this video, so we're just going to roll with it. All right, so yeah, that's the book. And that is the one that I originally had. And so I found that one, and then I also found this one, which is also Dear Lizzie. And it has these on the back. And then I found this. I bought this paper that goes to these a couple of videos back. So I thought those were cool. And then I found these, and these were packaged in some plastic wrap. And so I just thought there was like three sheets, but really they just never took it out of the plastic wrap. So I got those. I just saw these collections at um, at the scrapbook store, and they had it there. Too bad I, this, this is all I found. I wish I found more, but this is a Citrus Bliss one, and it was 99 cents. And then here's the Atlas collection. 99 cents and then I found these from pebbles it says it's pockets with inserts so that's pretty cool I think those would be cool to use oh here's the back and then I found this one from pebbles not sure how I'll use those because they're kind of big but we'll see so okay let me get this out of the way I found this paper. This is uh, Maggie Helms style board paper. And it was $1.99 for 12 papers. So I got this one. That's the patterns they have. And then I found this Heidi Swap one. When I find this stuff, it only makes me think, man, what did they have that I, I missed out on? <laughs> All right, so I think that was it from this morning. Me and the kids took a break on Saturday, and it was pouring here, and I went to this different Tuesday morning. I had found so many cool little things, and then their power went out, and their registers didn't come back on, so I couldn't get any of it. That's one of the reasons why I went back today to check mine, but, um, but anyways, there was a Michaels and stuff over there, so I w we went to Michaels, and I don't know. Um, this was also from Tuesday morning. I has I just pulled it out to use it. I used the black pen. It was two of them for I think five dollars. So I got those pens. Those were cool. And then anything else from Tuesday morning? Oh, these are from Michaels. I saw this set here. I thought this was really cool. Um, it was twelve ninety nine, but I used a forty percent off because it wasn't on sale. And all these little wooden stamps here and what it tells you you could do is you can stamp on these sticky notes and you can make your own sticky notes so you can use them in your planner or whatever and so I, I don't know I just thought that that was really neat and so I got them for like six bucks instead of or six fifty instead of the twelve ninety nine. that was from Michaels and then these were seventy percent off from Michaels I already used a couple papers from them for my journal I use this one and so I think these were two 
And then she had this. It was real picked over. And this, I think, was a dollar something. Little envelope page things. So I got that. Oh, sorry, squirrel. That was from Michael's. Um, this is going to be all mixed up, guys, because I just pulled a bunch of stuff that I started using. I should have just left it in my bag. These were from my scrapbook store last week. I went and is this the only thing I got? Oh no, I got two other tapes, which is buried in my bag. So when I pull it out, I'll show you. But um, they carry the Studio L2E line. And I got this icon stamps. I got this icon stamps. And see, I already used a couple. I was already doing my planner thing. And then I got this full paged one. And then I got two washi tapes, but like I said, it's buried. Okay, so let's see here. Now I have the stuff that I found today at my scrapbook store. So I picked up these Amy Tangerine Mar Remarks Alpha stickers. There's eight sheets, and they're different colors. And they say stuff like, let's get together, hey, hey, happiness, bright idea, you're my fave, this is awesome, to-do list, you make me happy, I love right now, so that was cute. And then I grabbed these because I liked the little die cuts. I wish this would have, I would have found this at Tuesday morning because it would have been probably like a dollar ninety-nine. but it's this little, like ephemera pack. And it comes with all this stuff here. So I thought that was cute. I thought this was really cute too. These um, strips, these papers of washi tape by Amy Tan. They're six pages. I thought that was cool. I love the one that's the map and this one. Really cute. And then I got this. Hero Arts Pineapple Stamp. I really wanted the, the Laura by Laura one, but it was sold out. Um, and then I got this Dear Lazy one there. I really like this one because it had these different fonts, like the real cursive-y. Oh, it was cute. That there, and that was it from the scrapbook store. Oh, this is from TJ Maxx. That's kind of random. And then this is from Michaels, but I opened it to use it in my journal. These were 40% off when I got it. This, this um, Becky Higgins Project Life one. And then this is actually from, see I opened these things, <laughs> um, Joann's. This little one here, and it's um, the We Made It brand by Jennifer Garner. It's for kids, but the, the sayings are so cute, like OMG. Um, Super, what does it say? Superstar, selfie, forever and ever, oops, whatever, BFF, like, um, really, XOXO, um, yeah, you know, it just has cute little things on there, and these were 40% off as well, so I got that, and then this was 40% off, so, um, I didn't know, you couldn't see inside the box that it had a wooden container, it was, you know, it was covered like this, so I thought, okay, it was seven bucks and there's more than seven washi tapes so I thought that was a good deal and then when I got it home I saw that it had this wooden thing and how cute is that so I thought that was neat okay so that's my desk cleared off let's see what else I got oh lots of stuff just piling up oh this is from Target I had gotten this little kitty pen case I think this is like three dollars when we were school shopping for the kids. My husband bought that for me. Oh, this was cute. This was a little blind bag. I got it from Michaels. And I wanted to get either Sally, Jack, um, or Stitch. Or Olaf. Olaf is cute too. But I ended up getting Winnie the Pooh. So, not horrible, but not exactly what I hoped for. Then I got this in the mail from, her name's Darlene, yes, she is oh, on Instagram, Crafty 808 Island Girl, but she sent me these 
Hawaiian sticky note things. Oh my god, they're so cute. These are my favorite. I love them. Thank you so much. I was so excited to get this. <laughs> so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, this is the card she sent. Isn't that cute? Mahalo. So I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna document it in my little journal here. It's gonna be really cute. So thank you for that. And then, oh, this came in the mail. The Stamps of Life monthly stamp. And then I ordered these off of Amazon. These came. These little Lego molds. So those are cool. Then... Oh, let's see. I found only one lonely pack of these sticky notes at um, Target. I found two of these at Target with this washi tape thing on it. And it was a dollar. I grabbed two of them, one for my friend. I found these. We went into Party City to get um, party favors, and these were a quarter. I thought these were the cutest little note pad thing. And I think I'm going to go get more of those. <laughs> Then I found these, and I grabbed two because I got one for my friend. Um, this was a couple, maybe a couple weeks ago at Tuesday morning. I had found this Heidi Swap pad and this Heidi Swap pad. Then this, this was when me and the kids went looking for their school lunch boxes. We went to TJ, no, Marshall's. I found this sticky notepad. Sorry you can hear them. They're trying to catch the cat. So I got that. That was a few weeks ago. Then I had found these little dollar stickers and I believe at the time I had a 20% off coupon so they're a little less than a dollar. So those were cute. I found those and then I liked these. There was a few other patterns but that's what I got. And then I got this Day of the Dead one. That. And then... Oh, this I found this at Tuesday morning, too. This Halloween sack. Oh, yeah. This is from Target. Uh, Bianca wants to decorate her little um, notebook. Um, I found this at Tuesday, yeah, Tuesday morning as well couple weeks ago. I found this there at Tuesday morning. I went out looking for um, some stuff for my mom for her birthday. And I bought her a bunch of, these are the, the Ranger Dilutions, you know, the um, art journal stuff. And I liked the octopus, so I got the octopus for myself. And then the rest of this is basically washi tape. And then I'm done. So this one and... Mm, where'd it go? These two are from the scrapbook store last week. I bought the flamingos and the pineapples. Then this one is from Office Depot. One of the like million times I have to go because I always need ink or something. The little fish are cute. And then this one was from Office Depot. Office Depot or Target. Both of them have scotch tape. That one. Oh, and this one, it was so bright. I liked it. And I think they were on sale that time is why I got a few at one time. And then this one is from Office Depot with the diamonds. This one is Office Depot as well. And this one was on clearance. It was like $1.41. This one was Tuesday morning. This one. You guys probably already seen this one. This was Walmart. I went to get um, some groceries and I picked this up and then uh, the donut washi for my friend. These two are from the Target dollar bin. This pattern, or pattern, fabric tape. And I found this gold tape. I didn't even know 
they had this until I saw Brianna's video. This is from Tuesday morning. And then these are both from Tuesday morning. This one's really cute with the cameras. And then this one has like date, important. Those two. And I believe, hold on, nope, that wasn't it. I found these two sticky or page flags. They were um, the only two, and I grabbed them, one for my friend. And then I also found, it looks like my cat scratched it, darn it, these at Dollar Tree, these Gartner leather-looking uh, journals with blank pages in there, and it has like a pen loop for a dollar, of course. See, it says Gartner there. I found red and I found silver. So that is everything guys. I've made a big mess. Oh my goodness. I gotta put it all away now. So um, yeah. Thank you guys for stopping by. And yes, if you noticed, I don't know if I mentioned it before, I did change my YouTube name again. Cause I like revamped my Etsy shop like a month or so ago. And I was just trying to make it all match, trying to make it all go together since you know, YouTube is connected with Google, and Google is connected to my Etsy, and just trying to make it all go together. So, yes, it's still me. The original, my original thing was Mrs. McCabe Scraps, and then I went to Paper Candies, and then now it's it's your party, Pin It. So, it's still me. It's still me, guys. So, anyways, you guys have a good week. I'm going to get some more of my planner and my journal stuff done and hopefully hopefully be back to show you guys what it looks like so yeah I'll talk to you guys later bye